Welcome to one of the most exciting fishing adventures anywhere. A full week exploring the fabled waters of the Amazon basin for monster peacock bass with Ron Speed's Adventures, America's leading international outfitter. Your itinerary will be a Friday to Friday getaway departing from Miami and arriving in Manaus, Brazil. From there, a short flight into the heart of the Amazon. As with any excursion, the anticipation of getting there is half the fun. Once you arrive at the river, you're shuttled to the otter and your adventure really begins. Ron Speed's Adventures offers you the finest peacock bass fishing experience of a lifetime aboard the fantastic Otter Houseboat. Your week on the Amazon will be aboard the Amazon's newest, largest, and finest houseboat. There are over 5,000 square feet for our adventurers to relax and enjoy. The Otter is a four-deck, spacious, floating hotel that can fish anywhere in the Amazon basin. Ron Speed's Adventures and the Otter, where they, they put, put together a really nice package of amenities on the boat. The comfort level was high enough to be sufficient, but not so, so high that you feel like you're not really in the jungle. And they made it comfortable, made it safe obviously, but we still felt like we were roughing it because you, you could look out your window any day of the week and see the river, see the animals, see the birds, and um, you had that, that feel like you truly were getting away. We saw sandy beaches, we saw rock structure, we saw flooded forest, timber, and you mix in with the fishing all the incredible flora and fauna of the Brazilian Amazon, and it's just a tremendous thing to describe. It's almost, it almost defies description at times. Been a blast. Big fish, great company, super camaraderie, super food. I'm planning on taking on a diet, but it doesn't work that way from being out here. But it's just been a great time. I would recommend anybody come down here and spend a few days with them and just enjoy Mother Nature and the Amazon. The staff was good. They washed your clothes every day. You don't really need, you know, to bring a lot of clothing because uh, they take good care of the, having that ready for you by the next day. Uh, the equipment for the conventional, the level wine fishermen, they had all the rods and lures, and the woodcutters and, and every uh, plug that they needed for this area. Rods were set up with 80 pound and they, they did great with them. Both be in the bow, they have good flat, also in the back like a flats boat. So they have good quality equipment. The engines seem to run really well. They have 60 horses on them so they can cover the water when they need to. And uh, the guides seem to be pretty savvy to the fly fishermen and willing to listen and, and move in closer and work with them. About 30 fish over 10 pounds with a 22 and a half being the largest and about a third of those were over 15 pounds. And uh, they'll break your heart in the aspect that I've, I've probably lost at least that many. I actually got hung up in a little bush and pulled it off and sucker nailed it. <laughs> right on top of a little bush. So it took absolutely no skill at all? Well, absolutely not. <laughs> it's your birthday? Yeah, 61 years old today. Happy birthday. I hope I'm not done yet. <laughs> They're in the brush. That's a beautiful fish, though. Beautiful fish. Right. They weigh him? 16 pounds. Two peacocks. A double. 
the master guide alligator. Oh, hold him up. I'm going to take some pictures. Though. All right. And you're going to just put him down in the water. Good to go. Now we gotta catch you a bigger one. Ron Speed. Ron Speed. Ron Speed's Adventures. With Ron Speed. With Ron Speed, so we did it. I just enjoy it. It's, it's great. This is, this is the best trip I've ever done. Definitely a good trip. I would recommend it uh, as a fly fishing destination. Uh, okay. Okay. Here's Tim with his 20 pounder. Mm -hmm. I was looking for the camera when he hooked this thing. <laughs> He's pretty excited. He, oh, I thought well. he was gonna kiss the guide. <laughs> <laughs> so the guide. <laughs> <laughs> Hold that thing up there. I'm gonna get a close up, Tim. There you go. There. Here's James fighting a big fish. Just landed a 16 pounder. He's trying to beat my 20. Oh shoot. Yeah! Woo! Woo! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> <laughs> All right, good shot, James. All right, how'd that? Good job, James. And they said you can't land him on a fly rod. <laughs> Look at how pretty he is. That's the male to one of the females, isn't it? That's a great time. Recommend anybody to do it. And come on down because they'll treat you like family and you'll enjoy yourself. But if you're willing to put in your time, you can find a big fish because it took me four days and when I found it, it was worth every cast leading up to that. It's doable. There was plenty of them. I think our best day between us, we had 14 was the biggest and we caught between 40 and 50 of them. Uh, he pulled like a bull jumped a couple times and when I saw him slide into the net and I saw how big he was, I realized, you know, this is why you come to the Amazon. After five and a half days of fishing, you'll return to Manaus, Brazil for a chance to sample some of the local hospitality and culture. Oh, we got to get him in the net. <sighs> nice fish. But I'm fishing with Ron Speed down here in, uh, on the Amazon, and I'm loving it. It's uh, fish like this that just make it great. And there's a bunch of them down here. Let's let this baby go for somebody else to catch later. We hope to see you soon. Peacock bass fishing in the Amazon basin with Ron Speed's Adventures, America's leading international outfitter.